The 1950 AMT Chevy pickup truck snap together kit coming up next on What's in the Box. What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in this box? What's in the box? Hello everybody, my name is Trevor Ursulescu and I'm the owner of Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada. And speaking of High River, we got a lot of farmers out here and I'm sure they're going to love to see this episode where we get to open up the 1950 Chevy pickup truck. How many of your grandparents had one of these guys back in the day? Well, continue to watch because this is a neat little kit. It's very fast to build and it's good for the grandkids. So let's go down and see what's under the lid. And now let's have a look at one of Alberta's favorite trucks of the 50s, the 1950 Chevy pickup. And this is a great little kit because it's skill level one, so it's a good introductory for the younger model builders. Now let's take off the lid and see how easy this kit is. Well, first off, you get your instruction sheet. And this kit was given to me by my wife on Christmas in 2003. Quite a wise, wise long time ago. <laughs> Quite a ways. Anyway, this is sort of the first of AMT's computer type photographic instructions. But as you can see, it's pretty easy. The wheels go right into the tires. The axles get uh, hammered in. Then it goes through the underpan. Then you get a steering wheel, steering column, dashboard, interior, and a bench seat. And your box is one piece, and the rear door goes on. This is showing how your glass goes in and the pieces you need to finish your cab. And then the whole kit gets screwed together and eventually looks like that. <laughs> Now let's see what the colors of this kit are and our parts. So here is the undercarriage. Now if you want to detail this with a bit of paint, it's pretty easy. You just need to paint your engine there and your exhaust pipe silver. And there's quite a bit of nice detail in there on the running boards. And here is the cab body and this is molded in that high gloss styrene plastic so you don't even need to paint it and there of course is the cab or the box and there's the holes here and hooks here so it's an easy twist and push up and then there's your your truck right there Here's the interior bucket, which goes into those holes there. Just drop down, and there's a little tab here and a hole there, so it would click in. And here's our chrome, a nice big 50 Chevy chrome grill. Very nice kit. and a one-piece windshield and rear window. So again, another easy snap fit. There's those wheels, and you can see how deep they are here. <laughs> quite the tires. And there's our tires there. These are brand new molds if uh, you need some of these kind of tires in other projects. And then Everything is in nice separate little bags, including your steering wheel, dashboard, and bench seat. And finally, your nice shiny chrome axles and the screws. And boy, these ones are really long. So make sure you don't lose them. <laughs> okay. And that... That is the conclusion of our examination of the AMT Ertl Snapfast 1950 Chevy pickup. Well, we hope you enjoyed this episode of Monster Hobbies What's in the Box, where we got to look at this old farmer's favorite. And if you would like to see some of the other kits in this amazing series, please click here, here, and here. And don't forget to subscribe to us right down here so that you can continue to see 
what's coming up next on Monster Hobbies What's in the Box. And until then, always remember to keep your hay bales.